new uh, phone went wacko. Yeah, just stick it under there. Spectacular, man. You gonna do any jumps, Logan? I don't really see anything. And okay. I don't feel comfortable. Yeah, I hear you. It's soft. Oh, yeah. A lot more sand down here than I remember last year. Yeah. They must have had some good storms. Oh, very good. For omelets. Okay. Mm -hmm. where's, your, where's your fire? Or is it just started to warm up? You don't need it. It's, it's beautiful. Yeah. You don't need fire. <laughs> yeah, the sun is pretty... Yeah, it's warming up nice. I guess it's going to be 64 today, so it'll be a nice day. Jackson, leave it. Hey, Tink. Hi. What's going on? <laughs> Jesse. What's squeaking in here? What's squeaking? Come on out. Wait, boy. Omelets or scramble? Omelet. There'll be some omelets for the day. Sounds good. You got any of that water left, David? Oh, yeah. Never mind. Uh, yeah, I pulled it all in there. Fine work there, sir. Yeah, it's a uh, profession that I've never really taken. I thought you were a storekeeper on a ship. I was a storekeeper. But, but storekeepers could be cooks too, right? In a... um, we had MSs for that. Oh, okay. We were multi-workers. Oh, okay, all right. But Especially if the, the cook went overboard. If the cook went overboard, you know, we try not to get them to go overboard. <laughs> we can get rid of like other people, but cooks are very important. Yeah, they are. It's good. Yeah, Yan Ken Cook has nothing on you. Yan? Yan Ken Cook. Yan Khan. Is that PBS guy? Oh, I never heard of him. Yeah. That means I'd have to watch PBS. PBS, yeah. You're, you don't strike me as a PBS guy. <laughs> Dave Schaefer, he's a PBS guy. Oh yeah, I don't he he don't. He, uh, he contributes every year. Well, you can't you can't hardly go to work anymore. You can't get away from the TV. Oh, that's true. That and his computer and sending bad jokes out. Oh yeah, got that too. I watched that charger last night. Hi. <laughs>
newspaper there? Yeah. So he forgot to pick up his newspaper. <laughs> this is where they'll move um, next week. This is really his? Yeah, this is what he improved. What's where we stayed last year? Oh, they added the frog and all that since we were here. Frog. They basically create art out of all the junk in the desert. It's got tons of it. They say nothing ever happens here, Man. but they're pretty busy. Those VW have caps are worth money. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. All just on there. Those CO2 cartridges and shotgun shells. My drinking gang has a biking problem. My what? My drinking game has a biking problem. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I heard his name. It's a well-known artist in L.A. that came down and did it. It's the Tire Mammoth. Cool. I think it's one of the coolest ones. that way but it's rough and you know you could get the I-10 that way but yeah you want to go out take a left and go down a ways but not too far and then take another left and then from there you're on your own all right, all right. <laughs> but you don't have four-wheel drive so don't worry yeah yeah you, you won't, won't you won't that. you won't need it <laughs> yeah as long as you stay on the road all right. and you okay. got survival gear right I do have oh that. good good Watch okay out, tinker She'll move eventually. She'll move. Drive safe, buddy. She'll get real flat. Come on, Tinker. No, thank you. We're looking for the interstate. Uh, I get that a lot because of the detour. <laughs> oh, now they've lost their way. Now they can't go home. <laughs> you sure you don't want one? We're sure. Thank you. Oh, they make Cracker Jack pets. I taught this one to shake hands. He's not for sale, though. Hey, who wants to go home with the nice ladies, huh? Oh, pip me, pip me. Oh, uh, don't be afraid. I don't bite. What's your name, pretty lady? Uh -huh. <laughs> what about Bucky here? He just loves to climb the trees and eat the nuts. Ma'am, we do not want a squirrel. Now, do you or do you not know where the interstate is? Well, of course I do. I'm not retarded. Tell him about the shortcut. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Bucky. <laughs> I almost forgot. There's a dandy shortcut that'll bring you right to exit 14. It'll save you 30 miles. Oh. <clears throat> okay, now listen carefully. You want to go straight down here, exactly 1.8 miles. 1.8. And you make a left at the Totem Pole Ranch. Go 5.4 miles. I'm going to go up a big hill, and you'll see a big yellow sign with some graffiti on it. And there's a little dirt road. Take that on the right. It'll take you right to the interstate. Thank you very much. Thank oh, you. wait a minute. Take some nuts with you, just in case you see a squirrel. Okay. Oh, I just love this. This is like a treasure hunt. You're good. Bye, Bugsy. Bugsy! <laughs> now Jax gets in on it. Ooh, she closes the gap fast. Oh, yeah. 
He's slowing down. Come here. Come on, James. Bring the ball. Bring the ball. Don't let that ferocious little white varmint get to you. Good job, Tinker. Good job, Jamie. Good job. Good job. Ha, ha, ha.